Welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. And I know I've been MIA. I have another channel, a cryptocurrency channel. That's my entire life. So I haven't been really on this one, but I need to talk about this Kendrick Lamar and Drake beef because a lot of people are missing some of the main points here, especially when it comes to how long it's taking for some people to respond. Like Kendrick Lamar has been MIA ever since Drake dropped pushups. Now people are saying, well, Drake took three weeks to respond. Let's talk about that. Now let's look at some facts. When did like that dropped. Well, like that dropped on March 26, right? Came out, shook the world. I'm bumping that thing in my car because it's a certified banger. Shout out to Metro Boomin, you know, make some drums. He's making some drums, but that, that song is great, right? So that dropped on March 26. Now, at that time, Drake was on tour. Drake didn't stop touring until two weeks ago. Now, I'm not going to let Drake off the hook that easy because in his most recent song, right, the one where he used the Tupac and, uh, you know, Snoop Dogg AI, he said that that song only took him an hour to an hour or two to make. Now, I don't know how busy a tour schedule is, but if it only took an hour or two to make, why not? But, you know, pump it out right there. But there's a reason why Drake didn't drop his diss track. You know why? Because we were still waiting for another diss track that he probably knew that was coming out by Metro Boomin and the Avengers, right? Pretty much everybody's jump, jumping Drake, right? Which is some real corn bullshit. That's real corny, right? Everyone going after Drake. It's like, it's a real obsession kind of weird thing. And I think maybe Metro Boomin and Kendrick and, and, and Future were like the brave ones who went first and everyone else started dogpiling and then whatnot. It's real corny. But look, Okay. What about the next record that Drake knew was dropping? You don't think he wanted to wait for We Still Don't Trust You to drop? So again, like that dropped on March 26th. Everyone says, Drake, respond, Drake, respond. Remember, this isn't Drake just versus Kendrick. This is Drake versus everyone. The reason why the Kendrick and Drake thing is so big is because one, Kendrick and, and Drake have been kind of like taking shots at each other for years, but Kendrick came out and said, you know, fuck sneak dissing. Fuck sneak this in first person shooter. I hope they came with three switches. That's pretty direct, right? And the whole argument is, oh, it's Kendrick versus Drake. Who's the big three? Yada, yada, yada. Who's a better rapper? Whatever, right? That's why it, 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 it's a big deal for people to get Drake to respond to Kendrick. But remember, everyone else dissed Drake as well. Metro Boomin, pretty much, right? Teaming up with all these people. Future, right? Rick Ross, now Kanye, right? So everyone's going after Drake. So this is not just a Drake versus Kendrick thing. So if you're Drake and the theme of your entire diss towards Kendrick and everybody else is, I know more than you do. You guys are controlled by people. Don't you think he knew that we still don't trust you was coming out? And that came out on April 12th, right? Literally weeks after the first album dropped. So Drake knew that they had two albums. So if I'm Drake, why not wait for both both albums to come out so I can diss everyone and respond to everyone all at once. That makes the most sense. That's why Drake didn't immediately respond to Kendrick because he knew that more stuff was coming out about him. So if I'm, yeah, why, why wouldn't you just address everyone in one diss track, which he did. Pushups came out on April 19th, literally what? Seven days after the second this album pretty much it's not just taylor towards drake right obviously it's a, it's an album but a lot of that album had the weekend on there right even the weekend too right dissing drake so he waited for both albums to come out so he can address everyone at once and then you know a few days later right he dropped the whole ai and snoop dogg and and, and, and what tupac thing right and now it's been 12 days and we haven't heard anything from kendrick so it's different and here's the thing right if you're kendrick lamar and you're not on tour, you're not doing anything except recording a song, right? One song with Metro Boomin and you go after Drake, you have to know he's going to respond. Did you think Drake wasn't going to respond? Why? Because some people think Kendrick Lamar is a better rapper than Drake, right? Because you have some glazers out there. You have some stands that think that now that's subjective, right? Whatever your style is, right? Whatever. You know, but what is objective is that Drake is a bigger artist, more consistent, more hits, way more consistent, right? Not just four albums. He has a ton of albums like him or you don't like him, whatever, right? He's been in mega beefs before. Yes. With Pusha T. Yes. With other people like Meek Mill and other people, right? He's been in mega, mega beefs. He's battle tested. When has Kendrick Lamar been battle tested? So why wouldn't you think if you're Kendrick Lamar, why wouldn't you think Drake would respond? So the fact that Kendrick Lamar hasn't responded in a timely matter and Drake is pretty much burying him in my opinion at this point, it just, you know, Drake's coming away with a W. Now here's the thing. If Kendrick responds and it's a banger, which he needs to respond soon because it's getting really old. I don't want to hear, oh no, Drake. I I told you why Drake took so long, right? Hopefully it makes sense to you. I don't want to hear that, right? Kendrick needs to respond. And even the pro Kendrick um, reactors on this space, 
they're just making all these excuses up and even said it they make excuses for you because because they hate to see me lit right it's just like no there's no excuses it's not the same situation kendrick is not as busy as drake so kendrick you're on the clock man i want to see this go down i know you have it in you to to do something but at this point i mean i mean it's like especially after that last diss i mean he kind of what can you do anyways let me know what you think in the comments down below that's my opinion peace